welcome to you you watch you guys cpsd youtube channel please subscribe channel for more videos and to get the right time support for few days today we are discussing about meta determination what is the meta determination we will see now what is the meta determination it is the process of substituting one product in place of another product for example if you creating the sale order with x material if x material is not available okay we are replacing of y material okay instead of x we are selling y material that kind of process we are calling we are calling as a meta determination the reason of substitutions may be this kind of reasons if business wants some other reasons also we can use the meta determination so like a product is now product is damaged and we are coming new product or product is not available or combo pack oh this kind of uh, processes we, go, we are going to use the metal determination okay the product is not if x metal customer place that x metal x metal is not available okay the similar kind of product is y okay if uh, client if uh, user acts i mean if the customer is accepting y material instead of x we, are, we can send y material okay we will see in a sap how it will work okay the configuration for metal determination spro img screen sales and distribution basic functions material determination here click on maintain prerequisites for metal determination first we need to define the table it is it seems like a pricing okay Pri how price can they how price condition technical work condition tables we are creating okay condition axis sequence condition type procedure assignment same like the data also made it was the same like a condition technique table as sequence condition type procedure assignment same steps you have to follow so here my client requirement is the material has to substitute based on the sales organization and material entered material entered nothing but what material we are entering okay what material we have to get so what material we have to replace that uh, that we are calling material entered so if client you if your client is asking the combination of sales or distribution division you can serve this okay based on the client requirement we have to generate the table okay 506 is the table number 506 next axis sequence a001 is the standard axis sequence metal determination if we see the table 001 is the standard table for metal determination we are going to create our own axis sequence zz01 yy01 it is also there then zy zy this is the axis metal determination axis sequence here we need to place table whatever we created that table we need to place here 506 okay after that we need to activate the table we need to activate the table save okay then go back next what we have to do condition type we have to create the condition up for that condition up we need to link axis sequence okay go to new entry this is the standard condition type for a metal information go to new entries zy zy is the new axe condition type for uh, metal information we need to assign our axis sequence zy zy if we valid from value to if it is the client is asking valid from value to we can maintain or else leave it okay next procedure same as table as sequence type procedure assignment five steps enough okay next procedure this is a standard procedure for metal determination i'm going to new one zy zy 01 
this is metadata determination select that click on controls go to new entries then what is the condition type zy zy save after that assignment go back go back this assignment we need this procedure metadata determination procedure we need to link to sales document why are the sales document here we need to link zy zy 01 okay save okay next the last one define substitution regions we need to create on define substitution regions go to new entries so zy zy the substitution region the reason is metal is not available entry if you check this okay um, actually what will control either the the substitution metal has to take the printout or main metal has to take the printout the printout purpose warning whenever the substituting material it has to give warning message or not okay strategy whether it is automatic or manual okay blank means automatic so item will be replaced item will be reviewed if you keep the blank what will do system will not display the system will not display the main material so both will not display it will display only substitution material let me save this we will test one scenario next what we have to do condition records vb vb g vb 11 vb 11 zy zy okay this is my sales organization substitution substitution region zy zy so whenever i enter this material system has to give this material so whenever i am entering this 62 material it has to replace it with 60 material okay you have measurement j each okay now i am saving now i am going to create one sale ladder now now i am creating sale ladder see whenever i am entering 62 material system has to replace with 60 okay see automatically 60 came right see again i'm entering see so whenever i'm under 62 meter the automatic system is proposing 60 because of we told to system replace material okay whenever we enter the x material uh, that 62 meter has to replace with 60. so client requirement is system has to display both both main material and substitution material both has to display and it has to be header price and it has to be header price in that case what we have to do select a outcome as select a and save okay select a and save we will create one more sale order now and we need to do uh, sorry we need to do the item card determination for header price we need to do the item card determination for header price this we have to do a means header price here we maintain a right a means header price b means item price okay just remember that okay for header price we need to maintain the uh, item card determination item card group now ps hp the item usage for material determination header price item usage is ps hp for sub material psel for main material pshp and sub material psel okay tx is the standard item category for main material taps is the sub material uh, item category for uh, item category for sub material okay this is standard uh, item that you can create your own you can assign here or else you can use a standard one okay item is we have to use if you see here so this is the main material this is sub material this is the main material when our main uh, pshp scheme automatic system will give the tax is a main material it, tax is a displayed in a higher level item category it has to take the taps is a sub material okay now we will create an order okay so both now both has to be 60 has to display and 62 has to display both has to display if you see here both displayed 
62 metal displayed and 60 metal also displayed. This is the main material. This is substitution material. You can see the item category also. TX is the main material and TAPS is the substitution material. If you see that in uh, item category controls, TAPS not relevant for pricing, not relevant for billing. TX is relevant for pricing and relevant for billing. Okay. If you see the price also, 62. Head allow price maintained. Okay. Head allow price maintained. The second sub material there is no price because of it is a A. A means head price. A means head price. Okay. Now we'll create on delivery. We'll see how it work. Okay, delivery. You can see. Don't need to pick the first one because of it is a it is it is not it is not a main material. I mean main material nothing but we are this we are not selling to customer. We are selling this one to customer. But our purpose to our reference to substitution of which material to knowing the purpose, we are doing this configuration. If a client don't want to show that uh, main material, simple here keep it as blank. Remove this, keep it as blank. Okay. Now I'm doing PGA invoice VF01 PGA and invoice. Okay. Now client one. Now client one item price. Then what we have to do? Maintain B. Instead of A, main, maintain B and save. Okay. For item price, for item price, item credit determination is same. But uh, item usage is PSA1 for main material submit to PSA2. For header price, PSHP and uh, see how system knows. Either PSHP or PSA1 means this is the control outcome. If it is A means header price, B means item price. Okay. Just remember this. Uh, we'll see the item card determination whether it is there or not. Slash and VOV4. YOR norm PS, PSA1. Okay, if you see PSA1 is the main main material, PSA2 is the sub material. Okay. TAPS is the not relevant for billing and pricing, it is relevant for billing and pricing. TAM. Okay. Now we'll create an order, we'll see the result. Okay, I am entering 62 material. Okay. See both material displayed and item categories you can see. For me, TAPA and item may submit is TAPN. If you can see the price also, it is mainly it is item price, not header price. Okay, so header level, item level, we have to maintain price. Okay, now I are doing the delivery and invoice. Delivery, see that this main material we are selling, not uh, the sub uh, main material, substitute material we are selling. If you want, if both has to display, we can do that. Simple maintain the billing relevance per TAPA system has to allow to do that delivery for that material also. Okay, this is the material, uh, this is the item carried material determination concept. Okay, next class I'm going to cover listing and execution. Listing and execution. Once again, thank you all for watching the video. Please subscribe channel for more videos and look at the items for a few days. Thank you all.